It's our first French athlete of the day, and normally that means lots of crowd noise. <laughs> and rightly so too, Mila from Mere de Lastan comes into this match as the ninth ranked archer. Lana Fernandez Infante, the second ranked archer. Mila from Mere de Lastan, John is just 15 years old. Wow. Done so really well. Really to, awesome. Uh, make this. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Well, she won her 1 8 elimination and quarterfinals pretty well. And then lost or beat her, sir, beat Oska Chitak, who we just saw in the bronze middle age. Beat her in a shoot off in the semi finals. And Leira Fernandez Infante also won her semi final in a shoot off against Roberto Di Francisco, who we just saw win the bronze. And then earlier won her 1 8 elimination in quarterfinal, six set points to nil. Again, pretty Fernandez. much the same as. Sorry, John, the pre same yeah, as the Fernandez previous match. You've got Leila uh, Fernandez yeah. Infante has got some good experience behind her, already competing at three World Youth Championships. She shot a 580 in qualifying, which is a very high score as well, Fernandez. So she's in the white, and this is Mila Framere de Lastan. Fernandez looks on fire okay, already. Uh, form is absolutely awesome. From Mary Dilastan coming back with her first 10. That is enough to win the first set for the Spaniard. Yeah. Into the nine zone. So a touched on the experience for Fernandez Infante, who's been to three world championships already, already medaled at events like World Cups and Mediterranean Games, European Youth Championships, gold medalist there last year in the team's event, silver in, in the individual as well. So she is a very good archer. But Mila Frameri de Lastan has also had some success at the European Youth Championships, winning a medal in 2022 as well. So. Two very good archers. And I tell you what, even though she's only 15, from Mary Dilastan looks comfortable with the environment, John. Absolutely. It, but she knows she's going to have that home crowd behind her. And that is a very valuable thing in this arena. So Spain, you're winning that first set 29 to 27. which means from Neri de Lestan goes first in the second set. Super composed like in the, her process. Isn't she? Yeah. Mm. From Mary Dilastan. Finding her range now. Three of her last four arrows have been tens. And Fernandez Infante just can't quite uh, 
get her range right at the moment. Just going a bit low with her arrows at the moment. Nine or higher here. Oh, yes. That's how to come back. Good adjustment there from Fernandez and Fante. But it's going to be the French archer who squares the match up with a perfect set. Like at 15 years old to stand out in that arena and to shoot down three tens like that. Absolutely incredible in this gold medal match. Yeah, I don't. I think we're in for a heck of a match here, actually. That was a nice adjustment, though, that the Spaniard made with that last arrow, John. Yeah, really important because she's looking a bit frustrated. She, I think she felt like her shot should have been tens. Which is like, and that's really, it does frustrate you, and you mustn't let that build in. She made an adjustment, she got the 10, so she has the confidence in herself again. This set now is going to be very interesting. Yeah, could swing it, no doubt about it. Two set points each. Lovely comeback by the French Archer. Just go in low again. Like that. Yeah, might just to grab the nine line there. Nine. <laughs> nine. Nervy. Huge arrow that one in this match. Could be a 10 that one. Well, there's no doubt about that one. That is a 10. But from Mary de la Stam, big arrow here. She scores a 10 here. She'll... Oh, just left. Just by about uh, three or four millimeters. Yeah, well, that was a, a big shit, one shit. there, wasn't it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Huge arrow from Fernandez to get the 10 on the third shot. The door was still open there for the French archer to take the lead. And the shot looked really good. And they were like, oh, wow, is that there? So, yeah, all square, real. Well, just uh, one of those uh, earlier arrows is a measure. I think it looks like it does. I think you're right, John. It looks like a 28 all score line in that set. Nothing between these two at the moment. Uh, from Mary de la Stan, looks like she was born for environments like this. She's just composed at 15, John. You know, it's. Uh, She's going to be more than comfortable when the big stage arrives down the track for her. Fernandez needs to find that 10 early and put the pressure on the younger athlete. Wow. That one she would like to have again. Yes, talking to a coach. Uh, from Mary Dillastan, set to lose now. The stranger things have happened. Still got to get the arrows on the target. Good comeback there from Fernandez Infante. Uh, 
Well, Fernandez and Fante need to ten here. Yeah. Great arrow there from the French archer. She'll take that set and go to match point. Can you hear that crowd cheering her on now? It just builds the confidence. Fernandez laughed that seven off, but inside she must have been crying. Yeah, she did follow in with two tens, but now the French athlete set there on match point. Fernandez has to win the next set to get a shoot off. Here's the instructions from the coach. I think for Mary de la Stant now, just three arrows away. I think it's three arrows of her life are coming up. The way she's handling it, she's going to have plenty more on the big stage in future years. Can she win? This title here. She beat the number one seed in the quarterfinals. And now she's looking to take down the number two ranked archer in the final. But it's going to be the Spaniard to go first. It's what she needed. She had to get that. Oh, I reckon that's just missed. What do you reckon, John? I think it's just out as well, yep. Well, that one's in. And this is exactly what the Spaniard needed to do. Brilliant response from her. Keeping herself in now. it. Big arrow here, isn't it? Huge arrow. Yeah. Yes. What a time to bang in the maximum score. Now from Mary I wasn't sure because of yeah, I wasn't sure it looked a little overheld and a little no. long, but she got it. She's missed that arrow there. So just to reiterate, if she got a 10 there. That first arrow was a measure which we think had just missed. So yeah. now that takes it out, and there's no doubt that we're heading to a shoot off now. What a great match for the gold medal. Absolutely. I think uh, Fernandez feeling the pressure of being the hot favourite. The French athlete is feeding off that crowd who are just carrying her. It's worth, worth a point and end, isn't it? So. Uh, there we go, confirmed shoot off. But I feel Fernandez's tens have been better. Well, great match coming now. We have a, a one arrow shoot off to decide the gold medal winner in the under 21 recurve women's competition here in the Indoor Archery World Series Youth Finals. Closest to the center wins. Big arrow here in the young careers of both archers. Mila from Mary de la Stanza touched on. Beat the number one ranked archer in the quarterfinals. Can she beat the number two ranked archer in the final? Be brilliant if she could do it. But Lara Fernandez Infante started well and ended well in that match. And can she go back to back winning? the semi-final and the final in a shoot-off. It's a great storyline either way. Interesting to see from Mary de la Stan, just happy, nice and composed, standing by herself there, soaking up the support in the crowd. And Fernandez Infante's coach still having plenty to say.
So a shoot off to the side, the gold medal. Mila from Mary Dilastan. Leira Fernandez and Fanti. It's going to be the Spaniard to go first. Closest to the centre wins. Oh, it's an eight. Huge opportunity here for the French archer. The door is so open. Yes! It's gold to France. Mila from Mary Dilastan holds her nerve and has got the gold medal in the recurve at just the age 15. Incredible performance from her. That's an absolute giant slaying. Absolute giant slaying. <laughs>